to save. Alright, okay. Well, that's fine. We know what we're doing now. That was kind of a rip. Um, okay, then. I can't search live twin because I don't have the star emoji. Uh, I think I put two frost and a treat in. Cross out. Goodbye. Um, nibs. What's that one called? Ghost Bell. Right, okay. Well, so we're missing droplets. We're missing imperm. Yeah, I could try copy and pasting the star, but honestly, that wasn't like that big of a deal. Uh, what did I have last time that I don't? It's pot. So, right, okay, save that. Uh, extra deck. Um, I will actually now copy and paste the, the star now. It didn't work, because the extra deck ones have a different ASCII. Uh, not ASCII, Unicode character. Ah, right, okay, evil twin, monster, where are we, Link? Uh, right, this is the new good one, isn't it? Yeah, this is the new good one. Uh, and I think we're probably still just playing two of each of the other ones. Wait, which is the the draw one? Uh, this is the draw, so we want three of those. Right, okay. Uh, Zeus is broken. Uh, Zeus is too broken, I think. Sounds about right. Um, we want to actually make Zeus. What else are we doing? Um, not Phoenix. Play uh, Griffin because that's good in OG meta right now. What's other rank five called? Was it a five or is it a four? Uh, yeah, this one. Is it this one? I think it's this one. I'm putting it in for now. I'm pretty sure it's that one. Right, we'll just double check. There's not like another one with uh, like a similar effect on a four link for some reason. I'm pretty sure that's the one though. It just scares me a bit that it says the above text is unaffected. Well, I guess because it's not had a translation, that's why it says that. Yeah, it was definitely that one. Um. I don't think I can get away with two of these actually. Um. Lilla's probably... Wait, it doesn't find... Oh, because it's got a hyphen on the database. Okay. And I've got one more slot, which is almost certainly for a link. Let's go look at the look at the links. Um... Do a quick scroll. Anything here particularly catching my eye? Come 
Well, an access code talker in, but I get locked out of anything that's not evil twin half the time anyway. I think it's gotta be something kind of. Oh, I could have just put borrow code in. That makes way more sense. Yeah, I just put borrow code in. This card's broken. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah. This card's broken. Do I want to put a topologic monster in my extra deck, though, then? Probably not. Yeah, I'm gonna say probably not. Um, I right, just fill in the side deck with like good stuff to deck. Anchor tops, token collectors. Uh, Lancia, I guess. Flying C, Flying C is the exceed one. No, not Flying C. Um, tell you what, we'll put in side frames first. Uh, side frames. Uh, what's the other C one? If I do this, I'll just get all the C's right. Retaliating C, yeah, it's this one. This card's good in OCG meta at the moment. Um, In a uh, harpies for the duster, not fairy duster. Apostrophe. I kind of like this a lot better. Um, what are we missing out on? Quite a lot of spot removal, got interruptions, got hand traps. I'm just putting twin for now. Decks that I thought about getting when it came out, like in uh, Max Rex, the collectors are all like eighty pounds each, something like that. Sixty to eighty people selling them for. But I just didn't. Um, it was like it was like slightly too much. Um, so we discovered it was red, blue, red. I think I want to set the entrance this time. Here's where I just get lightning storms and I'm a bit sad then, because they're all, all inside deck. <laughs> but I mean, that's fine. Cyclone, huh? I mean, yeah, sure, whatever. Cyclone? There's got to be some sort of mill deck, because I don't know why you'd ever play that otherwise. Oh, that's uh, Diablos, okay. Um, okay. Oh, this tributes, doesn't it? Hmm. <sighs> oh, for Christ, he's still got some Star Lotus. <laughs> okay. Um,. Do I want to go now? I think the answer is no. I think I still the answer is no.
I think we're still alright. Yeah. Yeah, so this is where the token collector comes in. Um, get rid of this. Each of these. I probably shouldn't have gave you this effect actually as well. Yeah, I was just looking at like this doesn't have the Mecha Thunder Beast effect, I'm fairly certain. I think we're still kind of alright here. Okay, we might not be okay anymore. Yeah, okay, we might not be okay about this one anymore. I should have just done it before we got to the Noodle Fiber, honestly. I don't know really why I waited. Either that or just on the Noodle. Double jet synchron opener. Yeah, I really just kind of let him get away with murder on this one. Maybe I live? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, if he's only doing this, then this should be okay. I'm kind of sad I didn't draw any like hand traps or anything though. This cross out designator is going to do absolutely nothing for me this game as well. If this was a cold buy, yeah. If this was uh, like a different hand trap or something, probably, but currently I think it's going to do absolutely nothing for me this game. So you can make a 7. You can make a rank 7, I guess. Uh, I don't know if you can get back to his Diablos though. Oh, we can make a nine. What the heck is this? Sure. Ah. Interesting. Yeah, okay, well there, he got back to his Diablos. So I'm just dead. I think that's not lethal though. I just don't know how I eat out this, really. Maybe. So if I activate three effects, it kills me. Okay, good to know. So my third monster effect has to be outing this? Nope. My second monster effect has to out that, which I do not think is possible. Uh, what do I not need? Probably this. Oh, okay. In which case, yeah, we're just kind of boned on this one. Oh, we're really boned because, yeah, Samsara Lotus. <laughs> okay, so I lose all my cards on the first card. Okay. Thanks to Siskin for this week's guest mix. That's all we have time for, my furry friends, but fear not. Parvo will be back here next Friday, same place, same time, with a guest mix from Protoculture. Yeah, that's what Until I thought then, might be happening. Thanks for listening. Look after each other. Bye-bye.
I think I need to go blue, red, blue. Oh, I think we can do both now, actually. I think drawing a card is less relevant now, though. Face. He currently doesn't get over it because it's 3 3. And it's also 3 am, so I'm gonna have to probably call it like sooner rather than later. Feather Duster, sure. I should have got rid of Samsara first, but I think that's okay. Uh, I guess we forced him to use it now. It's, I, I messed up, but I think it's still okay. Uh, no, we didn't mess up actually, because I've got this. Just be game winning. Uh, in fact, hold on. That halves attack. I don't think I can attack twice. It's half attack plus uh, what's that battle damage. That might be enough. So that's going to be at 15. So he's going to take 17, and this is going to lose 17. So 17 puts him on two, and then no, it's uh, sorry, 1100 over. Basic maths. Uh, this is gonna be on 600. Yeah, I think that's game. Uh, cracking remix of my favorite track from his recent album, Matzo featuring Olan Problems, remixed by Houseman. The warmest of warm welcomes to you. Thanks for tuning in to Groove Therapy with us above and beyond. I'm your host for this evening, Tony McGuinness, and keeping me company for the next two hours, Marsh, Tilt, JTEC, Simon Doty, Solar Stone, Crider, and Fluida. We have a guest mix from Eli and Fur, and news, views, and blues from our worldwide Anjuna family. What's not to like? Here's another from Alex Sonata and the Rio. This is higher. 